Hello children, welcome to the channel Speak and Span Learning. Today we are doing question answers of class 8 English 2, chapter number 2, The Old Man and the Sea. Comprehension, question A, answer the following questions. 1. Why was Santiago considered a salao? Answer, Santiago was regarded as a salao or the worst form of unluckiness because he had failed to catch a fish for 84 days. Question 2. What work did Manolin do as an apprentice? Answer. As an apprentice, Manolin used to haul Santiago's fishing gear, prepare food and talk about baseball. Question number 3. Where was Santiago going to the following day? Answer. The next day, Santiago was going out in the Gulf Stream to the north of Cuba in the Strait of Florida for fishing. Question 4. What happened on the 85th day of Santiago's unlucky streak? Answer. On the 85th day, when it was noon, Santiago realized that a big fish had taken his bait. He was convinced that it was a merlin. Question 5. How did Santiago lose his weapon? Answer. The sharks followed Santiago's boat as it left a trail of blood. Though Santiago was able to kill a big macro shark, which was the first to come, he lost his harpoon and a greater part of the long length rope while doing so. Question B. Answer the following questions with reference to context. Context number 1. Manolin has been forbidden by his parents to sail with him and has been told in teed of fish with successful fisherman. Question A. Who is Manolin? Answer. Manolin was Santiago's apprentice. B. Why has he been forbidden to sail with the person? Answer, Manolin had been forbidden by his parents to sail with Santiago because he was unlucky. C. Does he obey his parents? Answer, no, Manolin does not obey his parents. Context number 2. Santiago was now devastated. He felt that now he was entirely unlucky and defeated. He spoke to the sharks and told them how they have killed his dreams. Question A. Why did Santiago feel unlucky and defeated? Answer. Santiago felt devastated because the sharks had almost devoured the Merlin's entire carcass, leaving only its tail skeleton in head. Question B. How did Santiago drive away the sharks? Answer. Santiago strapped his knife to the end of an oar which helped him to ward off the sharks. C. Which is the last one. Why did he say that sharks had killed his dreams? Answer. The Merlin was a bright fish and Santiago would have earned a good deal of money by selling it. But the sharks had devoured the Merlin and so Santiago said that they had killed his dreams.